had its two points picked up in the trophy this evening against Northampton Town. Just talk us through that 90 minutes from your perspective. Yeah, I thought we started the game pretty well, dominated the game in the first 20, 25 minutes and then it became 50-50 and then second half. We started okay, but I still feel we could have done better. We could have, we should have finished the game with taking chances. I think there was one or two George in the first half, Tyreek in the second half, put the game to bed, you know. But yeah, I'm just glad we got the job done in the end. Obviously, the conditions was horrible, but I thought we played well and did what we should have done, yeah. And for yourself, you start very brightly a goal after four minutes. Do you feel that's been coming for you? Yeah, it's something that I've really needed. Been working on it every time in training. Just link up with BK, the wingers, the strikers, and getting behind and trying to get myself on the score sheet. And I'm happy I've done it tonight. And hopefully I can kick on from here. But I'm just happy that we won that game and now we're through to the next round, yeah. And we've spoken to you before about this, but you seem to be very much a confidence player and that is certainly going to be a massive confidence boost to you, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, most definitely. It's something that I just always felt if I get one when the season starts, I'll just keep going and that's the mindset. Hopefully it comes in now and that's what I'm working at, yeah. And you mentioned starting brightly. There was a couple of chances for the team do you think as a, as a team that the game should have been out of sight early doors? Yeah, I think when we were on top, we had one clear cut chance and then two shots from in and outside the box that were on target. And I feel like if we were just ruthless in that box, in the opposition box, I think that game would have been put to bed and, you know, would have just controlled the game. But it was, it was still open and it was 50 50 ish kind of. But yeah, yeah. But it is two points on the board this evening. It takes us up to five points after the two games. The team themselves must be quite happy with that return. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. It's just all about progressing, winning games, winning after winning. Obviously, at the weekend, we felt like we shouldn't have drawn that game. We should have won the game, you know. But we didn't, so we just wanted to get back on that winning, winning way and just keep winning. That's what we need to do and then hopefully carry that into Saturday. So that's the most important thing, but just confidence in the boys. Like We don't doubt anything and we just want to keep on going, yeah. Effectively, you've come away to two very difficult teams in Exeter City and Northampton in the last two games and you've kept them at bay for, for large parts of it. You've picked up you know, a good point on Saturday at two points here. That must again be a real good confidence booster for everybody in the squad. Yeah, it is. It really is. And it's something that we believe before the game and we're trying to win every game, you know. So the confidence is there and we just want to take that into Southford on Saturday. So, yeah. And just on a final note, 124 fans here this evening. Very tough conditions, as, you, as you've mentioned. That must be really good for, for everybody who's out there on the pitch to see them there supporting you on a Tuesday night. I thought they were fantastic again tonight. They always are, you know. And to come make this journey up here this night in these conditions and to still be there for the full 90 minutes, it's a credit to themselves. And we just wanted to show them that we, we support them and we're happy for their support as well. And I'm thankfully thankful. Thanks. We want to thank them as well and safe journey home tonight. Yeah.